So past few months, so a lot of things have happened from uh, example at Ubisoft and their Assassin's Creed Unity issues and of course the Watchdog issues, uh, Square Enix and that massive Final Fantasy 7 troll which I may talk about in a later video and Cap Capcom with their copyright strikes for legitimate videos and it just makes me wonder, well, you know, why do they do this? Is it just stupidity or do they just want to try and make as much money at the cost of their reputations? Um, I put the blame on the publishers themselves. I know there's some exceptions like for example I know Total Biscuit and Jim Sterling have always had uh, issues with uh, developers as well. Um, but as someone said on Game Trailers, it often happens that a developer makes the first game uh, and it's released and they can be even shut down before even the, the, the sales of that first game are known. Uh, and every time something bad happens they do lose trust of the people who actually pay for the game. Take the game Destiny for example. Um, they had record breaking scales to begin with but I suspect it was due to the reputation of Bungie and uh, many people who play the game in will be willing to take a second chance with them. I do wonder what the breaking point will be. I do not want uh, video games crash in the 80s but with buggy games and so much nickel and diamond going on I reckon it's probably going to happen in the next 10 years or so. Uh, all I could say is uh, if they get more people who have a bit more common sense and treat the customers they want to be treated themselves.